Hi there, this is Gijsbert Pols from Ingenious Technologies and today we are going to talk about progressive attribution. Progressive attribution is a method developed for advertisers who establish lifetime client commitment, such as online bankers and telecom suppliers. The problem for these industries is that no commission can be attributed to their main conversion target, namely the registration of new customers. Let's start by discussing the problem a bit deeper by looking at this picture here. What we have here is a touch point for AdSpace A, the registration, a touch point generated via AdSpace B, and finally, a sale. Of course, this is a simplified example of a customer journey, but it is very realistic. One can imagine customers clicking on an ad in Google or a link on a consumer blog and deciding to create an account for the service of the advertiser. Because finance and telecom offer expensive products, it will probably take a while before customers proceed to order, say, a credit card or a subscription for an internet service. Meanwhile, customers will surely produce new touch points. They might click on a retargeting banner or directly type in the URL of the advertiser. The problem we face here is that you can only attribute commission to the sale. The registration is not a commercial conversion target in a sense that you do not generate revenue with it. In most cases, this means that AdSpace B gets commission and AdSpace A goes away empty-handed, although it was able to generate the most final vital conversion target in the customer journey. Progressive attribution tackles this problem. You apply progressive attribution to the most vital conversion target in the customer journey. When you do this, the sale later on in the customer journey will be attributed to AdSpace A, the ad space that generated the registration. In fact, all future sales will be attributed to this ad space and it will be granted all commission related to them. One more important thing. For progressive attribution to work, it is vital that the customer ID is transmitted. With long customer journeys, customers might disable cookies. It is also likely that customers will register and purchase subscriptions on different devices. However, when the customer ID is transmitted, you do not need to bother about such media discontinuity. Sales will be attributed using the customer ID and lifetime value for AdSpace A is guaranteed. Instructions on how to apply progressive attribution can be found in our documentation. Don't worry, it's relatively easy. That's all for now. We wish you a wonderful day.